Alright guys, and here's the MS form for the Wing Gundam Zero HG number 174. This basic stuff for him, uh, this locator here. Um, okay, we have these two pieces. It's for the feet when we transform to the Neo Burn Mode. Just plug those on, like this parts former basically for transformation. Alright, next up, you get standard like two beam saber hilts. Very nice um translucent green here. But the problem I have is um for these beam saber uh beam saber hilts, there's nowhere to store on the on the mobile suit. They have a gimmick right here where, it, where the shoulder um the top of the shoulder's white piece opens, but I can't put this into the gimmick, so what's the point of making the gimmick anyways, <laughs> if you can't even use it, right? Uh, it looks awkward actually, I'll show it right here, okay. okay. Alright guys, alright guys, here it goes. <laughs> See this, uh, this part right here, and this way. And, you know, these hilts, okay. See, can't even hold on to it, but I don't know. Um, <laughs> there's no way story, so I just probably put it back in the box, you know. Yeah, last thing is uh, we got the shield, pretty cool looking. Uh, just a few pieces stuck together, and uh, one of the small gimmicks is this right here. All right, the extension of the shield probably makes it longer, probably like for more defensive pieces. Um, yeah, I really think this is pretty good, but uh, I got it for a good price. I got this uh, in a shop called Wonderland in uh, Hong Kong where I live, actually. And very close to my my home in uh, Lantern, actually. And it's pretty cool. I like this kit. I like the Wing Gundam Zero. And um, I think I'm probably get, getting the other one, the Wing Gundam, just the normal one. I have the RG one, the... Um, Wing Gundam Zero EW. That was a nice kit. I like the wings on that thing. But I think this is more like an anime, anime, oh, for, sorry, anime um, um, version of the Wing Zero. I really like it. It's a solid kit. Cool and uh, it's, it's pretty uh, cheap actually. Um, it's around like 1,000 yen. I got it. It's like around, yeah, uh, 85 bucks Hong Kong dollars. Yeah, so it's alright actually. It's a fun build, a uh, little build. Just put some, uh, I just did go ahead with did some lining panel line uh, with uh, the Tamaya uh, panel, panel, um, or bad, bad, uh, uh, market, uh, pink hit there. So, uh, yeah, um, I'll show you a little 360 with kit. Those things can open and close. But uh, if I think I get into like a, uh, dimen that sort of dynamic, iconic pose like this that will leave everything open in the hatch or something like that. <laughs> I think it's pretty cool. It's my style. I don't know. Um, fixed fixed is uh, very few on this, this uh, model kit. It's on the yellow here, the yellow here, and of course we have it on the eyes, the front camera, the back camera, and this little jewel right here, which I uh, underneath I ping some like. From silver to make it shine more. I think I probably have to do a more little uh, better job at the at the uh, detail painting for this jewel. I think it, uh, it's not really clear. So uh, I think next on the next kit I will do better on it. <laughs> uh, try and there, guys. Uh, yeah, and those wings inside I really uh, panel line now, both sides. Um, because we want the panel line for this kit, you know your gun colors, right? But the problem is like most of these exposed areas very it's like I don't know 70% of the kit so I think you have to put some panel line and uh to you know let those uh, detail like really pop out and looking good. Yeah. It doesn't matter. I think it's good for practicing and when you learn the wrong way. Okay. So uh I'll see you guys next time and um catch you on the next video I'll draw you know okay? Okay, bye.